I don't know so many areas in this game, but a fast tra a fast travel system would have been nice. Yeah. Or a faster walk cycle. Oh yeah. A very rare Diridango cocktail. All for you. I can't believe it. Thanks. Now he's ready to tell oh, the truth. We killed him. <laughs> I just need to connect with him. I will surely regret it. That, that's the usual that's result the of trying to drink Snorri's brew. <laughs> Hold your nose. <laughs> Never mind. Game over. We're all dead. Maybe the deer a dango. Oh, we're in that part of Sam and Max, are we? Apparently, we are. Yes. It's impossible to lie. Now I have to find the wholesaler. And you know, I don't think lying is a problem for him. Hello, me. Are you my conscience or something like that? It's it's that one Spider-Man meme. I am you. Stop pointing at me! Stop pointing at me! Point is rude! Stop pointing! I already can't stand myself. Now I have to stand you, too. Relax. The annoyance is mutual. Now please excuse me. I've got to go. And who are you? Detective Gallo. I'm quite popular in my neighborhood. What is popularity? He really I thought he could lie. <laughs> no, he believes he's person, if not a target is popular in his neighborhood. Rather, who are you? Why are I you mean, because he's got one admirer. I'm Socrates, but to know why I am in your head? I so you should have been Storcrates. What are you? A damn shrink? So great. I died because I was accused <laughs> of telling the truth. Can this be really a fault? It depends whether you're really guilty or if you just have a bad lawyer. Shut up, or I'll arrest you for a breach of silence. You can't arrest me, I'm already dead. What's this, a quiz show? Know thyself. This he clearly didn't, must didn't get a uh, falcon and spouse. Clearly. And who knows? The right answer was, who knows? Tomorrow is another day. I'm not Probably sure ended up with Kokoriko. Leave me alone, and I'll leave you alone. And who are you? I hate talking to strangers. Yippee! Oh God, it's baby Huey! Do we perhaps know each other? You're my hero! Every self-respecting chick wants to become a chicken! <laughs> oh god, is this the punk? What makes you think you'll be a chicken one day? My chick sense! I foresee the future with you in front of me! The problem is that you're in my head. What place is this exactly? A place where everybody is really themselves! Which came first, you or the egg? Good question. I don't know. The proto chicken. Sincere, but ignorant. I'm tired. Goodbye. Already? Hello. There you are. How could I forget a rude and idiotic shrimp like you? How dare you, grave digger face? I'm objective. After all, what do you think of yourself? That I'm a rude and idiotic shrimp. But I always tell everyone that... That you're competent, critical, and careful? Yes, to give me authority. What's the harm? That you'll sound like a perfect fool. But if it works for you... Tell me about the invigorating fertilizer. I don't feel like it now. Is the UFO in your store a replica? Obviously. But I sell a hundred per month organizing fake alien kidnappings in the shopping malls. Do you care more about yourself or your emporium? What a stupid question. My emporium. 
And if in an instant your Emporium was destroyed, how would you react? Very badly. My whole life would never amount to anything. Rule number 784 of Gallo. Life is like stock market trading. To hell with you and your rules. He has more rules than the Ferengi do. <laughs> no, please, don't do this to me. I think if us county had about perhaps in the morn. You act like the tough one, but you wouldn't kill a fly. It's a bit difficult with a revolver. Kill someone and I'll tell you what you want. Kill someone and I'll tell you what you want. Not now. Kill someone. We have to pick one of these to die. Yep. I mean, one's already dead. I have no reason to do it. Wipe that ridiculous mask off, you cheap copycat. You just paid yourself a nice compliment. Now that I get a better look at you, I see we're really different. No offense, but see you never. Enough. I have to get back about my business. I have no reason to do it. I think you got more than enough reason to do it. Yeah, what well, have I forgotten? I have no reason to do it. And I hate. Maybe you didn't get all the conversations done. Hmm. Uh, damn noise flags. Yeah, uh, I mean, to be fair, there is that one other door we haven't checked. Unless we shoot Hello. him. <laughs> How long will you extend me credit? So long as I think you can guarantee you might actually pay me one day. And how long will you think that? I'm making my calculations. Keep on insulting me, and I'll let my revolver answer. If it isn't the violent beak of the law. Don't keep this up. I'll make your feathers blow up. Is it my fault I'm in front of a braggart playing the part of an investigator? You know what? You brought this on yourself. Except, really, I never killed anyone before. And I will certainly not start now. If you don't have the guts, what do you need this old piece of junk for? It's a matter of style. It's part of my character. Is stupidity another part? How dare you, gravedigger face. I'm objective. After all, what do you think of yourself? That I'm a rude and idiotic shrimp. That's your carpet? Yes. To give me that you'll sound. Is the fertilizer you're selling poisonous? You act like the tough one, but you wouldn't. It's a bit difficult. Kill someone. I can start by killing you. Be my guest. But then you can say goodbye to your information. You know what? You're more cynical than I thought. I'm a salesman. Now go, and come back with a victim. Yeah, because apparently the only thing you need to do is make sure you get all the dialogue done. I must kill you. I don't think I get it. You get it very well. Rule number zero of Gallo. Humility is the foundation of everything. Hello. Do you remember me? How could I forget? I killed my ego. Well, you've made progress. I'll tell you everything I know and about the yet, just the for the rest so of the game. I can become a bobab in just a few seconds. So it's really invigorating. Yes. But then, how did Phil Chloro's plants die? Better leave before becoming violent for real. And to hell with rule number zero. Yeah, I don't think humility was any part of your act before. So, 
fertilizer isn't the murder weapon. Gallo! Phil Chloro? Uh, yes. C -c Come here, right now! I'd rather drink another Deeradango, but I have no choice. I work for you. W what did you say? I'm coming. The, 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 the Detective Gallo, about the fact that you work for me. Let me explain. I'm working very hard, but the case is more complicated than I thought. After I searched the neighborhood, I learned that the shell casing I found here does not belong to the murder weapon. Uh, and? Then I established that the fertilizer you use is not poisonous. So, have you found the c c culprit? Not exactly. Great! Great? I don't n n need you anymore. G can't you see? From now on, other elegant and silent friends will b b brighten my days. Have you replaced the victims with other vegetables? What do you take me for? I simply l l let some new friends come to keep me company. Friends. Are you hiding uh -huh. from me? Do you think I c c killed my treasures just for the sadistic urge to replace them w with some other beautiful specimens? D -d -d do you think I'm a psycho? My opinion doesn't count. The facts speak for themselves. You may be a p -p -p professional, b -b -b but your facts say too much for my tastes. How long did it take to forget the pain of your exes? Uh, just long enough to p -p -p pay the wholesaler by bank transfer. So, do I have to stop the investigation? If you want to continue investigating b -b -b by yourself, go ahead. But I won't p -p pay you any more. There's still reimbursement of expenses for exceptional movements. B -b but you said you only wandered around the neighborhood. Leaving my office is an exceptional movement. You really are a professional, but you won't get a penny more. Is that clear? I have to think about it. With my cactus. Professor Stortonist. Rule number 12 of Gallo. Money comes and goes, but Chief's Gates remain forever. I have more questions now than when I started my investigation. It's the first time that this has happened to me in a paid investigation. Because this is my first paid investigation. I mean, it was. But now's not the time to split hairs. You don't know how much it bothers me that I didn't solve the case. I just needed to... This is Detective... Gallo! The little flower in my emporium has been barbarically killed! Just a drop of water was enough to knock him out! Please calm down. I'll get there as soon as possible. Gallo, you have to help us. My plant has been killed. Mine too. But mine died first. And you all want me to investigate for you? Yes. Okay, I'll think about it. Boy, they're really into their plants around here. Apparently. I'm getting the impression that Gallo's the only person who investigates it in the neighborhood. Am I bothering you? Yes. But I'm used to it. I still need your help. If it's about watering your salad, you can also. I just d did that, and my n n new treasures. So are his new plants are already food. dying or dead. Hello, I'm on my way with the speed of the look. My fresh greenhouse flowers, they were so thirsty. And now they're as dead as doornails. You are better as a fortune teller than a detective. It's obvious. A serial killer is indiscreetly butchering plants and flowers. The first question is, why? The second is, how did he do this? The third is... It sounds like the water supply has been tainted. When will you go away? I don't get it. You don't have to get it. You have to go. If you don't have anything interesting to say. You're hired again. I'll b b b b pay you double. Triple the advance I gave you. If you solve the c c case, my regards to your c c cactus. It's lucky to be still alive. 
He has a point, Thorn. You're lucky I don't have to water you every day, or else by now, you would have ended up like all those other plants. Poison water, dead plants. There is no doubt. The water has been used as the murder weapon. But how? And by who? I have to search the aqueduct area and find out what poisoned the water. New location! Da, da, da. I don't know what to do with it, but it's always better to have one with you. If I had a hammer, a hammer in the morning. I've always dreamed of being a miner. It'd be a shame to leave it there. I'm the ghost spelunkin, I guess. What a shame. The effect was just temporary. Aww. It's out of ammunition, but there's still the seed in that pile of earth. Let's try. Wonder of modern chemistry. Well, that's convenient. <laughs> me to admit it, the we built the bridge. It only took us like 10 seconds. <laughs> and we didn't have to blow anything up. Oh, no. I lost the key to my office. Quite an inconvenience. Oh, we lost the key to the office? Yep. Oh, I guess uh, we're, we're breaking in go. later. <laughs> we're going to have to go looking around somewhere for it. Uh, Lost it while going over the bridge, which means we have to get down where that worker is. Worm! About the vegetable Worm. That door. I have to enter the dump. Only then can I prove the poisoning of the groundwater. What adorable magnificence. A wonderful specimen of a female cactus. Are you hitting on my cactus? <laughs> you, you always hit it from me. Why? The secrets of a cactus are unspeakable, even to their loved ones. You always know how to surprise me, old bat. I mean, miss. But I'll continue to call you Thorn, if you don't mind. Rule number 700 of Gallo. You never stop learning from the cactus. Rule 700. Yep. Clear, clearly, we need to get that worm and tie it to a string. Rule number 288 of Gallo. Most disgusting. Oh, that's not a worm, that's a maggot. Okay. It was clearly a worm. Second hand investigator, but not inventoriable. You might need to talk to the dude. The platform. Yep. Also talk to the dude digging down there. That's a second hand investigator. Rude. We collect, but rude. We're clearly just a half wit. How about it? Do we need this rock? Because this guy ain't gonna talk talk to us otherwise. Hey. I'm assuming he can't really hear us anyway with the helmet. Hey. Bong. Can I have your attention? More ears, especially since I don't want to be hit again. What kind of work do you do? Sewage maintenance. It's a dirty job. I know, I know. Let's move on. That strange building is the city dump, right? Yeah, that's right. Very close. Too close to the aqueduct tower. So... All the dump's waste could have polluted the groundwaters, which feed the aqueducts, and then spread the contaminated water throughout the whole city. Is it possible? Brilliant deduction. But it just so happens that the dump has been here forever, and nobody has ever complained. What does that prove? That maybe the groundwater feeding the aqueduct isn't connected to the dump? Too many plants have died. I'm sure the evidence of this slaughter is in that dump. We will find it somewhere. Very well, Sherlock and Watson. Get on with it. The key to my office fell down there. The water is already washed into the sewer system. I'm sorry, but I can't help you. Rule number Drats. 17 of Gallo. 
Don't throw. What was rule number 17 again? You can't remember rule 17. How's the aqueduct tower accessed? Nobody can get into it, at least not by the door. Is there an alternate way? Yes, by passing through the aquifers. I'd soil my coat. I wouldn't be so picky. You can be smart and clean at the same time. I'll find an alternate way to the alternate way. Oh, wait, we've seen your office. I don't think you have to worry about trying to be both. <laughs> Since then, have you ever got any rest? To rest, I would need to get comfortable. But the ground here is hard and I have neck pain, so I prefer working. I have pretty much exhausted every topic. Goodbye. It was all your pleasure. 